Now, before I start stabbing people, I just want to say to the guy who thinks I'm trying to blackmail him, no, I'm not, and I have no reason to do so, although I guess there's no way to, for me to prove this to you unless I just don't do it for all eternity. So, uh, let's get on with the video. Now, any of you who've watched my channel for any amount of time will know that I'm kind of bad at PvP and Skywars in general. So, today I'm doing a Bed Wars, which I actually know how to rush, kind of. Except because I've been playing in 1.18 recently, all of my controls are scuffed, so... Someone over there is clearly nearly as good at bridging as I am. Okay, right, I'm just gonna grab some more blocks and then, not, yeah, I'll just grab like some wool, rush in there, grab emeralds, and then you'll see my tactic reactivated. My sensitivity is really low, even though it's like 140%. Am I talking ridiculously quickly, or is this just me? Probably me talking ridiculously quickly. Okay, that's a blue thing. Emerald here. Blue guys over there. So if I come over here, I can stab them. Okay, so you so just joint rush them over there. Cool. I'm just gonna grab these real quick. All of them. Oh no, I don't want to. Okay, right. Let's head back over to our base. I know I don't want to head in there. So I'll grab the one here. I can get invis. I'll just. Okay, an invis pot for now. Look at that, it's a red guy, not a blue guy, cool. <coughs> Honestly, we need a better bed defense. Yeah, you know, let's just... Cheers, pickaxe, axe, some blocks just in case. Invis and jump. Jump slightly longer. Right, I need all a bunch of that, I guess. Okay, so it's on there. Shall we just grab some TNT? Yeah, let's do it. Pickaxe, axe, shears. I can't get shears yet. Okay, there's that guy right there. He could pose a slight threat to us. Okay, he's just gonna TNT. Or not. Oh, because it's the other guy who is going to TNT. Or oh, get stabbed by all of us. Cool. That works. Oh, I actually killed him. Nice. Honestly, I was so lucky. I had no idea which of us was. Ah, that could be a problem. You know what? Let's just rush it now. Yeah, that was a mistake. Also, I don't have shears, so I'm probably not going to be able to get that bed. This is probably going to be a suicide mission. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Took No, that failed. Let's try that strategy again, shall we? This time, let's like limit my frames somewhat. If I, I'm not even sure. I I literally cannot turn anything else. I mean, I could turn the render distance lower. And particles on. Particles, all off. That's like literally the only thing I can do. Actually, I, I could probably no. yeah, There'll be a noticeable difference now, maybe. Right, this time we actually need a defense. I'll chuck some endstone on there before I rush this time. Endstone, wood, and wool. Do it. 
You you never defend with a wall to start with. Just move. I can't tell if everyone else has bad internet or if it's me or, or a combination of the two. Okay, they have people who know how to bridge. My render distance is still ridiculously low. My sensitivity feels way too high. Yeah, I'm, I'm convinced this is my internet. There's no way everyone is just teleporting all over the place. Yeah, I'd say that failed. Time to actually do something this time. Okay, cool, they're both dead. Right, only thanks for just building a bridge straight to your base, guys. And I'm gonna grab some permanent shears and then completely... Oh. Okay, yeah, you can do that as well, I guess. I suppose the ladder also works. A temporary solution. Oh, I forgot you have to walk into ladders rather than just holding space in 1.8. That that was the that was intentional. It was it was a it was a strategy so that I can see exactly which block this guy's making and then walk over and stab him. There we go. Perfectly planned. He fell into the void as I predicted. Hello sir, can you die please? I said die please. I'm really bad at this game. I literally can't even get back up. I mean now he's stuck unless he has blocks, which he almost certainly does because... Who am I kidding? Of course he has blocks. Yep, he had a block. Alright, time to just run over here and stab this guy. Mission accomplished. Now, I'm gonna completely ignore him now that I have blocks. Come over here. Stab the other guy. Oh wow, their bed's gone. Yeah, that was effective. Oh, that's probably going to be gone in like three seconds though, because there's a, there's a blue guy right there. Okay, I had an explosion by impression. Yep, fireball. Okay, it looks like this guy's dead. Yeah, this guy's dead and the other guys have diamond armor. Or, oh wait, no, that's a red guy. Okay, where's, where are the other people? Hey, hello? Where is everyone? I buy a track of river wasn't for the fact that that guy just nabbed all the emeralds here again. Oh no, that's one. Not two emeralds, okay. Okay, one guy's there. Okay, he's probably just gonna run over there. Hello, sir. I see that fireball you have. Okay, that guy's up there now. We do a little trolling. So, die please. I have a feeling I was responsible for him staying on. Did I even hit him? Probably not. Oh well, that guy just rage quit. GG. And the world is spinning! Schizophrenia time, no, like that. Epilepsy. Right, let's try and win this again. Oh yeah, I just remember the entire topic of the video, Chaos Magnetism. I probably completely mispronounced that. Oh, yeah, so basically, Chaos Magnetism. You've probably heard of other similar things that go by different names, such as uh, 
I don't know, like the quiet kid or troubled children or something. I don't know. Why is it always children? I don't know. More like bad luck charms, possibly, although it's usually objects that people have rather than people themselves. Yeah, the main difference about this, though, is that very, very few people know about this, and it's almost entirely involuntary and subconscious. It's basically a person, well, usually it's a person, sometimes it can be a group of people that only do it when they're together, that kind of have, kind of just cause, of, or always end up involved in fights, even if they don't like enjoy arguing and stuff themselves. I suppose it's just like the person who gets blamed for everything all the time. Epic fail moment. Actually, no, that, that's not too bad. That was more bad. That doesn't matter, I have access to wool. I'm getting really bad at aiming today. Actually, that's like six misplaced wool. Yeah, great idea, let's just run inside each other and assume that the floor exists. Oh, well, I, I, I don't want to go overconfident. <laughs> But I'd say we've probably won this game. Oh well, one of them's rage quitted already. Okay, they're just trying to 3v1 me. Yeah, that didn't work. Imagine taking full damage. I'm sure I just saw someone there. I mean, there was a guy in blue armor crouching. And items are picked up, so I don't know. It's probably the guy behind me respawning and going to the forge to pick up items rather than rushing out. Uh, Chaos Magnets, why don't we keep forgetting about the top main topic of this video? We got like nine minutes in without me discussing it. Yeah, so basically, uh, I've noticed it seems to occur based on, like, we'll have experience the effects more. Okay, that guy knows how to play the game. Yeah, uh, basically, you'll experience the effects more if, if you yourself are a Chaos Magnet, you'll experience the effects more if, uh, like, the more time you spend around people in a short period of time. Like, if you, if you only spend, like, a couple of hours that, like, if you only meet up with someone maybe a couple of hours every month or so, you probably won't notice the effects. But if you, like, go to the same school as them or the same workplace or something, and spend several hours a day, most days a week, then that is going to show the effects a lot faster. I've noticed, though, it seems to... Probably because of, like, psychology, brain waves, electrical signals and stuff. I notice it seems to occur a lot quicker online. I'm not sure if that's because you tend to spend a lot more time, like, a longer period of time in a row with peop the same people, or if it's just because electrical signals. Or whatever, I'll just chuck and stone around it. It's unlikely that they'll get here anyway. Best bed defense ever. I mean, like, who attacks from the spawn point side anyway? Other than clever people. Which don't seem to exist in this game.
Honestly, everyone should just use the regular chesters. Other than the times where there's just one person who hoards all of the stuff, you usually end up with spare stuff that you don't use for the rest of the game. Okay, there's a blue guy down there. I can completely ignore. That was an epic fail right there. This blue guy's low. He's also running. And teleporting. Take damage, please. You guys saw that. It said zero health, right? I'm not sure if that just means it's below one. As in, like, I'm not even sure how health works. I'm pretty sure, like, half a heart is one health, and... Hmm. Maybe you regenerate health, like, fractions a second or something. Okay, there's this guy over here. You can die, you can die please. Oh wow, if it wasn't for the fact that I died, I would have called that mid medium level PvP. I really need to get some kills this game, like, at all. Or I might just go back to Sky Wars again. Yeah, so uh, feel free to comment or, like, comment your experience, I guess, or join my Discord server in the description. And then I think I have a stories channel. I'm not sure it's still in the progress of being revamped. Yeah, like, feel free to, like, tell me or contact me or something about your experience, either as a Chaos Magnet or with other people who happen to be Chaos Magnets or just, like, whatever terms you've heard it by before or other similar things. So, uh, yeah. As I said, Discord server link will be in the description. We have some, like, I think we have one channel that's active because it's a dark channel that's specifically designated to one person's OC. And they just, like, occasionally post art there. And then it's just, other than that, a pretty standard Discord server. We have... This video has just turned into advertising my own Discord server, hasn't it? But also, if... Okay, cool, I'm not blue team. Should we only have three people? Oh, wait, no, one of them is just constantly dead. Yeah, also, if you uh, happen to enjoy the game in Terraria, I will be playing a modded playthrough of that in the future. Dude, that diamond sword was a waste. This is a guy who knocked me into the void twice before. I saw the red thing flash up after I fell into the void and I was instinctively about to type slash... Not rejoin? I, I, not rejoin. Play, slash play so low underscore insane. Okay, time to go and stab the last guy. Where is the last guy? Is he running through the middle? Okay, that guy just fell into the void, so he's probably returning to our bed. Oh wait, no, the other guy's here. He's being 2v1 and he's still alive. Yeah, yeah I think he's dead now. Speed... I think those guys had auto GG as well. <laughs> yeah, that's it for this video. Uh, please... Uh, let me... That's it for this video. Please like if you liked. Uh, feel free to subscribe if you want to see more videos like this. Also, I discovered that one of my friends has overtaken me in subscribers. I will probably not post his channel link in the description. And I will see you in the next one. Goodbye!